God as your father. I will be a father to you and you will be my sons and daughters, say the Lord Almighty. Our father, we need you desperately to show us where our father have influence of perceptions of you. We need you desperately to empower us to forgive where we have been neglected and abused. We need you to replace lies with truth about you and uh, who you are so that we can be free to be all you have uh, uh, created us to be in Christ. Thank you, Daddy, for doing this. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. God always has time for you. Sacrifice for sin is no longer necessary. Therefore, but brothers and sisters, sins, since we have defend, uh, confidence to enter the most holy place by the blood of Jesus, by a new and living way opened for us through the uh, curtain that is his holy, his body. Our Father, beloved Father, I praise you and thank you for you have given us uninhibited 24-7 access to you through Christ. I praise you that you are never too busy for us, that you are never distracted by other things, that we can experience your intimate attention and full affection any time and all the time. Amazing. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Being a part of God's family, Holy Mother Mary, she turned toward him and cried out in Aramaic, Rabboni, which means teacher. Jesus said, do not hold on to me for I have not yet ascended to, you, to the Father so instead to my brothers and tell them I am ascending to my Father and your Father to my God and your God for those God for, uh, for new he, al uh, he also predestined to be comfort, uh, conformed to the image of his son that he might be the firstborn among many brothers and sisters. Heavenly Father God, your word says that if we receive Christ, you give us the right to be called children of God. Beloved Lord, I want to live as your child. I want to be a sibling of your son. I want to learn dependence on you as I learn to live by grace with my other brothers and sisters in Christ. Thank you for your mercy. Thank you for your love. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Your place in the family of God rescue for he chose us in him before the creation of the world to be holy and blameless in his sight in love he predestined us for adoption to uh, sonship through Jesus Christ in accordance with his pleasure and will May your prayers echo his prayer. My prayer is not for them alone. I pray also for those who will believe in me through their message, that all of them may be one, Father, just as you are in me and I am in you. May they also be in us so that the world may believe that you have sent me. I have given them the glory that you gave me, that they may be one as we are one, 
in, I in them and you in me so that they may be brought to complete unity then the world will know that you sent me and have loved them even as you have loved me hallelujah 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 an amazing aspect of who you are in Christ Mary she turned toward him and cried out in Aramaic Rabbani which means teacher Jesus said do not hold on me for I have not yet ascended to the Father go instead to my brothers and tell them I am ascending to my father and your father to my God and your God Heavenly Father God your word says that if we receive Christ you give us the right to be called children of God beloved Lord I want to live as your child I want to be a sibling of your son I want to learn dependence on you as I learn to live by grace with my other brothers and sisters in Christ thank you for your mercy thank you for your love amen hallelujah amen being truly alive for those who are led by the Spirit of God are the children of God the spirit you receive does not make you slave so that you live in fear again rather the spirit you received brought about your adoption to sonship and by him we cry Abba Father the spirit himself testifies with our spirit that we are God's children now if we our children then we are highest highest of God and co higher with Christ Abba Daddy my mind can only care take me so far conform my belief to the truth of your word then beloved Lord would you make these uh, truths come alive in my heart I want to follow you Heavenly Father God so for who you are as my dad for who I am as, as a fully adapted child I stand aside and submit to the leading of your spirit in the name of Jesus I pray hallelujah amen Rule of your sleeves and so a heavenly harvest each and every day you you are the answer to an ancient prayer that Jesus asked his disciples to pray he said to his disciples the harvest is the plentiful but the workers are few ask the Lord of the harvest therefore to send out workers into his harvest field faith enough to finish Jesus promised that life is a, with him wouldn't always be easy but the hard times we face always have a purpose to chis chisel us into stronger more Impactful followers of Christ your full inheritance of God's child the spirit himself testifies with our spirit that we are God's children now if we are children then we are highest highest of God and co-highest with Christ if indeed we share in his sufferings in order that we may also share in his glory not I consider that our present suffering 
are not worth compare, comparing with the glory that will be revealed in us. Hallelujah. Beloved Jesus, you promised me that I would have trouble in this world. Give me the faith to embrace my sufferings on this earth as part of the full inheritance of the Father just as you did. Give me just a glimpse of the glory that will be revealed in me so that my suffering can be accepted from an eternal perspective. In the name of Jesus, I pray, hallelujah, amen, heavenly Father God, hallelujah, amen, my beloved Jesus, hallelujah, amen.